Hello and welcome back to Memory at Lightning Speed with a permanent memory sphere and power recall. Intro three, the fast method for learning anything. Memory at Lightning Speed, warm up three. This session gets me excited every time. Who doesn't want to learn fast? I know I do. And let me assure you that there is a fast method to learn any subject quicker. I'll give you a hint. The secret is in the name itself. Bites from this session. One of the keys to be a faster learner is to start with a beginner's mind. Your permanent memory sphere works not by consuming information, but by creating and co-creating it. Be fully present and don't focus on other things that are not urgent. Learn with the intention of teaching somebody else specific. Change your physiology changes your psychology. As your body moves, your brain grooves. The fast method of learning anything. F, forget. You need to forget what you know about the subject. Forget situational things that are not urgent. And temporarily forget your limits. A, active. Learning is not a spectator sport. Practice, take notes, or ask questions. S, state. All learning is state dependent. T, teach. When you teach something to somebody, you get to learn it twice. Join the tribe. To join the tribe, please go to Permanent Memory Sphere on Telegram. The link is down below. Welcome back. My name is Achim Lemke, your permanent memory sphere coach. And in this session, I'm going to share with you my four secrets to learn any subject or any skill faster. The four secrets to learn any skill faster. This is really exciting. Who doesn't want to learn anything faster, right? So I'm going to ask you right now to think of a goal or skill that you want to learn faster. It could be marketing, it could be music, it could be Mandarin, or it could be your memory, right? In order to do that, I want you to remember the thing called fast. F, A, S, T, FAST. It's an acronym. It's, let's do this together. The F stands for forget. F, forget. And you go like, Achim, it's supposed to be a memory quest together. Why are you starting with forgetting? I would say this. One of the reasons why people do not learn a subject or skill faster is because they feel like they already know something about it. So they can't learn something new. Does that make sense? One of the keys to be a faster learner is to start with the beginner's mind. One of the keys to be a faster learner is to start with a beginner's mind. If your cup is full and you can't put new information into it, I'm going to ask you temporarily to forget what you know about a subject. Let's say you want to learn a new subject and you have a teacher in front of you. Maybe it's on sales. Maybe it's on health or like that, or relationships. And you have some background knowledge. I'm going to ask you temporarily set aside and 
so that you can learn something brand new. Three years ago, for my birthday, I just drove down to Italy and I joined uh, an international choir. And we've learned and rehearsed every day for a week. And then we had a, a, a gorgeous, brilliant, successful performance in a huge church. When we were performing and sang our soul out, our heart out, in my mind, I said that thing, you might have heard it before, that your mind, your voice is like an opera singer. It only works when you open your mouth, your throat, open throat singing. Your mind only works when it's what? When it's open. You want to be open to new ideas. Temporarily forget about what you know about the subject so that you can learn something brand new. The three things you need to forget what you know about the subject. The second thing I would ask you to forget is situational things, situational things. Now, what do I mean by situational things? A lot of people don't learn faster any subject or a skill that you're looking for because their mind is somewhere else. Does that make sense? If 25% of your brain is thinking about your kids, 25% is thinking about your clients, and 25% is thinking about the situation you do to do with work or something, that only leaves you 25% for your focus to be present. And I look forward to seeing you in the next session. Thank you for watching and listening. If you like the video, please feel free to share it with others as you see fit. Now join my library. There are more than 220 videos for you to watch and learn from. I see you in the course Next click on video 42U, it's for you. Watch now and learn more. See you there, bye for now.